Welcome back to Daily Planet. Lots more still to come, including some very slow-moving guests right here in the studio. Turtles and tortoises from the Indian River Reptile Zoo in Peterborough, Ontario. In a few years, this guy will be as big as this guy. And you'll see them both coming up later on Daily Planet. Okay, here we are, three humans, three turtles. Which set is better looking? <laughs> They're all amazing. I go with the different. turtles, actually. <laughs> Bry Loist is here from the Indian River Reptile Zoo. And a trio of turtles. Uh, give us a little ID on each of these. The one you're holding, Jay, is an uh, alligator snapping turtle. They're native or indigenous to Florida. And you say snapping. Why is that? Um, because sometimes to defend themselves, they snap, and that's only because they're frightened. Okay. But uh, are they as uh, aggressive as the snapping turtles we're familiar with in Canada? Mm, not even, not really, no. The, the ones that are native to here are a lot more aggressive. <laughs> you They're, say as you yeah. hold it very gently. Well, yeah. <laughs> and he has a very, very neat appendage. What they do is they hide in the bottom of the swamps, and they open their mouths wide, and they have a very pink-like tongue. And it looks just like a little worm, and then when a fish comes, swims to get the worm. Cool. Snap. Snap. Yeah. And then what do I have right here? What you have is a, a juvenile or young African spurred tortoise. So a tortoise. So could yeah. you give us a, a refresher on the difference between a tortoise and a turtle? Uh, the, main, the, the difference between a turtle and tortoise is tortoises usually live on land, and turtles usually live in the water. And there's something about their hind legs, too, isn't there? Like with uh, um, turtles. Well, they do have, have elephant-type like feet, right. tortoises. If you, his foot's kind of hiding there. That's what right. they do. Okay. And this is the only freshwater turtle that actually has flippers, kind of like a sea That's turtle. That's a beautiful turtle. What is yeah. that? This is a pig nose turtle or a fly river turtle. Absolutely beautiful. And where does it live? This one's from New Guinea or Australia. Okay. Yeah. Now, I know that we've got a very gigantic one that's hiding back there. Can we you... do, yeah. That's the, just like that. The same species well, as Well, should that. we go back and take a look, check them out? Sure. Okay, well, great. We hold on to your turtle. <laughs> exactly. It's like a little parade. <laughs> and it's, the, it's the turtle parade. This is look amazing. Look at this guy. Okay. He's only been here for a few minutes, so he hasn't gotten all that far yet. What's this, bro? That is an African spurred tortoise, the same as this kind here. Now, these look remarkably different. Why is that? The reason is, is uh, a lot of people have them as pets, and they don't, and they don't feed them correctly, so they get these, these bumps. Okay, so do we really know what sad. kind of diet my guy's been fed on? Um, either too much of the wrong diet or too much of the right diet. Okay. So they come from uh, Ethiopia, for example, and it's very, very desert and there's ver barely any plants at all so they don't eat very often so if you feed them too much they grow too fast and right. they get deformities and we can see right here this gigantic tortoise as we were saying has big elephant like hind legs whereas the turtle that you guys have here have little flippers on their hind so, legs so are any of these susceptible to predators uh they all are when they're young yeah yeah, yeah. but i wouldn't imagine too many animals would take on the big guy not at that size their, their only enemies is habitat destruction and humans right same old story, of course, that you yeah. hear every time. Fabulous animals. Thanks a lot, Bri. We can do our own little magic show with these guys. What's hiding under the shed? I'm the only one that's getting peed on, though. Bri right. Leist is <laughs> the Indian River Reptile Zoo. He will be back tomorrow with some more fabulous reptiles.